is er ook een lente. We are here at Lapalale in the Waterberg, where we are with the INEOS sponsored students who started in the Kalahari at Swalu and now they have moved here to Lapalala where they are in their second six month semester and it has been wonderful to watch their development. In the Kalahari the substrate is very impressionable so to learn to track there is a perfect place. But here in the, the Lapalala area of the Waterberg there is lots of rocks, it's stony ground and it's really testing their, their skills as trackers. Moving from Tualu to La Palala, it was really hectic. I was like, look at the terrain. Am I going to trail here? But now, it's something that I'm used to. Now I'm getting it right. So the group we have here come from a variety of different provinces, speaking different African languages. They've all had to come together and really form a team. The biggest challenge for me was adapting to new people and new environments and new things that I have never experienced in my life. But after a while getting to know each other, living together, eating together, training together, we became a family. They have to take on an enormous amount of information. This group have logged over 700 hours already practicing the ancient craft of animal tracking. It was good to see them putting into practice the skills that they've been taught. And this is what's important about Tracker Academy's work is that we're not just training them for the sake of training. It's not about the qualification. We want to ensure that these young men and women go into the conservation industry with skills that are material and that are valuable to the, the protection of wild animals in southern Africa.